So here's what finally made me stop messing around with random water sources. I moved into a new apartment last year and the tap water tasted like wet cardboard. I ignored it for a while until I started waking up super bloated. My energy dropped. I thought it was my diet or stress. Turns out the pipes in that building were old as hell. The water had iron, lead, and all kinds of junk. I got a filter, not one of those tiny pitchers, but an under sink filter that cost like 70 bucks. Life changing. Within a week, my stomach stopped acting up. My skin even looked clearer. And when I went back to drink water from the gym cooler, it tasted like pool water. I couldn't believe I used to think that was clean. The biggest lesson, clean doesn't mean clear. Just because water looks fine, doesn't mean it's safe or good for you. Most people never check. They just drink and hope for the best. But once you taste good water, like real clean, mineral balanced water, you can never go back. It's like eating fresh fruit after years of candy. Your body knows the difference. Now, I'm not saying you need to panic every time you take a sip, but don't just assume all water is the same. Try tasting water from three different places back to back. Your mouth will tell you more than any ad ever could. And if your water tastes weird, that's your sign to check where it's coming from. We always think of food as the thing that affects our health, but water, it's the base of everything and it's way more complex than people give it credit for. So yeah, that's why water doesn't all taste the same. It's not your imagination, it's minerals, it's chemicals, it's pipes, it's where you are and how you live. And once you understand that, once you actually care, you start paying attention. And when you do, your body thanks you in ways you didn't even expect.